Hey everybody, this is Arthic, and we're back. This is on my main tune. Uh, we just finished a mission. Um, <clears throat> me and my friend keep uh, trying to coordinate our schedules. We <laughs> it's been a crazy week, so uh, it's been a little bit of more building and whatnot, and uh, just wanted to do a quick video, mainly to kind of store this and save it for future references and whatnot, but uh, this is... Uh, well, basically what I ended up building is uh, I was uh, killing time for this mission. This is the Avalanche Expedition, um, which, you know, on the map, it's actually down here in this bottom corner. You have to get a laser. Uh, you have to put it down. You do have to craft some kind of a power source and uh, get into there, and then there's an exotic node, and basically that's, that's the mission. So... Uh, Mainly, it was this build up to tier four that was um, uh, to to be able to you know make a solar panel or a power generator or whatever. And I decided to go for the solar panel since I haven't actually done that for a while. And uh, I thought that was a bear noise, but it's just a buffalo noise. Um, but uh, yeah, this is kind of what I came up with. Um, overall, kind of happy with this, um, though. Some a uh, couple cu couple of oddities um, I will point out is that uh, random times when I've logged in, I've uh, things have gone missing. Like there used to be um, a lot more of these uh, wood crops. Um, I had five on this lower one, and then five up here on this one. And uh, when I logged in today, they were missing. So. Um, Okay, uh, a couple of times before the rail when I logged in, the railings were missing, so they had to be replaced. And uh, a couple more times back further than that, um, once the crafting this carpenter table went missing, and uh, the anvil went missing, so uh, that that that's a little oddity there. But um, just thought I'd mention that. Um, but uh, yeah, we did the uh, mission yesterday. Um, my friend has already blasted off, so I just decided I want to do a quick video, uh, before, um, actually, uh, blasting off myself. So, um, this is the front of the main house, uh, as we walk in. Um, it's kind of the kitchen, dining room, lounge kind of area. Um, I kind of did, uh, a little makeshift kitchen. I've got more than enough <laughs> fat. Uh, this is also right after an update where um, now even though it's in an ice box uh, we're we're losing um, you know we're losing food food starting to spoil even in an ice box uh, I guess that was uh, one of the last updates that just happened um, so that'll be interesting I guess <laughs> I guess this is a way to make sure I stop being lazy and I actually start building the actual refrigerators, though I understand that even the refrigerators don't... Oh, I got a dog. You're ruining my... You're ruining my video. Making... Making horrible dog do death noises. Yeah, that's... Not... That's not cool. <laughs> Alright, let's get this out of here. Come on. We don't want to attract any more this fixed get that fixed my goodness anyway um, but yeah so I, I started playing around with baking a little bit more uh, I generally really haven't done a lot with it but I really kind of like the uh, pumpkin bread and um, the fruit pie and then I usually just stick with one of these little uh, you know the better meats I guess and uh, that really gives you a good stamina boost and uh, you can run a good long ways with that. Um, I also was playing around with the craft, uh, not the crafting, the uh, trophy table. So, you know, I got my little deer head and my little uh, bear head and whatnot. But, um, yeah, overall, I mean, I really kind of like how this turned out. Um, I, I, I'm i really happy that, you know, a couple weeks ago we got the rustic uh, bench. Um, some of this new furniture is definitely... Oh, we're going to have another dog problem. Goodness gracious. That, that Actually, the funny thing is, is um, we're, I just decided to choose building um, 
right where we landed. So uh, I, I haven't really been bared. I think in the, I mean, we've been playing this for at least a week, uh, trying to coordinate time to actually do the mission. Um, I think there has been three hull bears the entire time, there, but there has just been wolf attack after wolf attack. But anyway, on with the tour. Uh, I kind of ended up making this little, like, uh, I don't know, living room. Uh, sit back and enjoy the the scenery room. Um, anyway, I really, really liked how that turned out. Um, I kind of, my thought was thinking that this was like the hobby uh, closet or something, you know, uh, that, you know, the, the hobby being making the uh, rustic furniture. So there's that. And then up here, I just kind of did a quick couple of bedrooms. Um, got some candles going on here. So of course we can get the candle uh, light going and light up the place, which, you know, this starts looking pretty good even at, at night which is kind of nice. Um, though, we've had some random fires with candles, so I'm not really sure what the rules are for candles, but uh, <laughs> uh, hopefully they'll, they'll be okay for the few minutes here as we're getting close to a, kind of an evening time anyway. But, yep, that's the main house, and um, oh goodness... And I noticed, just noticed the wolf has, um, there we go. Let's just go ahead and have a bandage. There we go. Um, but, uh, this turned out to be the, uh, work shed, I guess, for lack of a better way of putting it. Um, just some basic storage. Um, I started, I started putting the wood in here. What the heck? Let's add some more in there. Um, and that was my sulfur, and then this turned out to be the oxide and the silica storage in the end. Um, I am just going to go ahead and put everything away, even though I'm about to blast off and lose it all anyway. Might as well get it all sorted. Um, here I, I did all my ore storage. So I've got quite a bit of platinum and gold and titanium and whatnot. Here's my copper and iron. Um, you know, set up my glass table. Uh, in the center, I kind of left this to be what I called the tier four area other than the carpenter bench. The carpenter bench was as actually against the wall, but when I came in, it was it was missing one day. I d I, it actually caught, took me a day to realize it was missing. So by the time um, I put that in there, <laughs> I realized that the crafting bench was gone, so I had to make another crafting bench. But other than that, I left all the Tier 4 stuff here in the middle. And then this is the first time I've ever really kind of played with the lights in the game. So one thing I think would be kind of cool is if we had a better way to control lights. If we had um, maybe a light switch or something that we could you know, wire up or something, but I, I will say working with the wires has also been a bit of an interesting challenge because, like, for example, I ran I ran this the best I could a couple of times. I finally just kind of gave up. I did the same thing up here, and then when I logged in the next time, instead of these curling like this one did, um, suddenly these two were taut. <laughs> So, I'm not really sure exactly what happened there, nor am I sure why this one still has a bend and why that one still has a bend, but anyway, I thought that was interesting. Um, other than that, I don't know what else I can really kind of show, but um, hopefully, now I've kind of got this uh, recorded, and um, I'll plan on doing a few more of these as um, I'm getting more and more into the building and less and less worried about the um, actual um, missions and whatnot. Uh, I've actually been really enjoying the, the building part of this game. So um, let's see if I can actually get this to work this time. A couple times I, I just fall off the ladder. 
But uh, yeah, so that's that's it. This is the end of the um, Avalanche Expedition. And um, well, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, I hope to be doing more of these and I'll be doing more videos at the end of those missions to show kind of the base and or bases if more than one happens. But um, hopefully we get this disappearing bug fixed one of these days. And you can actually see that the candle is kind of already starting to glow through there. But um, for now, I will uh, go ahead and just say thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you in the next video. Till then, see you later.